Nine men, including a local former corrections officer, facing charges tonight, accused of trying to meet up with a child for sex. Action News Jack's Bridget Matter joins us live now from the St. John's County Sheriff's Office. And Bridget, the deputies had some different tactics when it came to tracking down these suspects. And the sheriff's office, they do these operations sporadically, Tanika. They say that some of these undercover officers, they'll pose as children. Others will pose as parents offering these suspects access to their children. Here are the nine photos of those mugshots uh, from Operation Downpour, which was a two-week undercover sex sting. Nine men accused of trying to meet a child for sex. Some of the undercover officers posed as children. Others posed as parents. Among the nine was Clarence Thomas, a former corrections officer who worked with JSO from 2011 to 2015, which is why his mugshot is exempt. We first told you about Thomas in 2015 when he was arrested on sex charges, accused of having sexual relationships with students while working as a part-time coach at Westside High School. Thomas recently, uh, recently, his arrest report includes the conversation police say he had with an undercover detective who was looking for a man to teach her daughter things. This is a portion of their conversation. Thomas accused of saying he's a 28-year-old personal trainer, having two kids and single. The undercover officer says okay is 12. Uh, her child is 12, a very sweet girl, too sweet, sometimes too trusting, you know. Thomas replies, so are you looking for a father figure for her or a teacher? Thomas, he was arrested on lewd and lascivious charges as well as traveled to meet and lure a child after computer use. For now, we're live in St. John's County, Bridget Matters, CBS 47, Action News Jacks.